when you play in a bowl game, you got a whole month to prepare. And so it's all about how you use your time. You know, we're in Tampa. It's beautiful. You know, you could take that time and sit and relax and enjoy a vacation, or you could continue to prepare. And uh, and we prepared the right way. We took we clearly maximized our time that we had, and we were ready for everything they threw at us. What was your view from the sidelines on the first Tyler touchdown, the, the high catch in the back of the end zone? I was like, welcome to Tyler Johnson SEC. You know, they, uh, that, that, that just shows what Tyler can do. And, um, you know, a play like that, I was super excited, but I wasn't surprised. Tyler made huge plays all throughout the game, and that's the type of player he is. Thanks, Carter. Congratulations. What, what, what does it uh, mean to you to go, to go out like this? This is why I came here. This is why I wanted to come here. Um, I like to think this is a catalyst for, for what will what will be, um, the way that the Gopher football program is going to continue to succeed. But this is this I couldn't have imagined going out in a better way. This was this was awesome. Boye had a big sack today. Um, do, you, do you think he could be due for a pretty big year next year? Absolutely. Boye Mafe will be a name to know coming up next year. He's gonna he's gonna snap next year and uh, open a lot of eyes. I would you describe the level of confidence that you guys had internally? Did you guys think New Year's Day? Did you think double-digit wins? Yeah, we we knew we were going to beat this team. Um, we were we were incredibly confident when we went out to the field, and uh, we wanted to earn some respect to, to our name. You know, mm -hmm. throughout the entire season, it was one of those things where we have to earn everybody's respect, and, and we did this year. We earned the respect and um, respect from other conferences now, and. Now that's just a wake up to the rest of the world. Let's go for football's coming. I know you guys try to put every game behind each other, um, but did Wisconsin linger? Did Iowa linger? No, it didn't. You know, that's that's how we're trained. We're trained to respond. So, you know, when a game like Wisconsin happens, it could be all right. Well, screw this. Like that. That was emotional for me. You know, for the rest of the seniors, it could have been all right. Well, you know, we're, we're done with this. That was that was a heartbreak or whatever. Um, but it wasn't like that. We're, we're trained to respond. So same thing goes when we our offense throws an interception in the first three plays. Defense responds. When the defense blows coverage, offense responds and takes it to the touchdown. That's what makes this program and this team so special. And uh, Gopher fans are going to be seeing a lot of that in the future. I mean, yeah, media obligations afterwards, but was you? I think you were maybe the last one on the field. Was that because you wanted to be the last, or was that because you had know, media things? You know? Uh, I don't know. I didn't really want to get off the field. You know, I didn't want to take off my jersey because that's the last time I'll ever be wearing it. So, um, so it was a little bit of both, I guess. But, um, but I, you know, I, I would have liked to stay out there as long as I could. What do you think the, the senior class has set up this game to do? Um, I think I think that you know we <laughs> back in high school we talked about being the empire. Right, you think of the Roman Empire, and that was domination. And uh, you know, obviously, that that all has to start somewhere. And so, I think that that we kind of started that. I think that we were a part in making go for football what we've always dreamed it could be. Um, I know that the go for football program is just getting started. It's ne next year's season's going to blow this one out of the water, as exciting as this one was. But uh, but I, I'd like to think that you know the, all the work that the seniors put in and the rest of the team, all that kind of stuff, is just set Minnesota up to be a, a force to be reckoned with in the future. Auburn's run game struggled today. Mariano filled in for Kamal. Um, do you think that this was one of his better games and, and something that he can build on as he's kind of a, a leader next year? Yeah, I think Mariano is going to be an unbelievable linebacker. He's incredibly sound. He knows our defense inside and out better than anybody else. Um, and. Uh, and he's, and he's just a ball player. He's got a knack for the ball. So he's going to be a stud coming up in the future.